Once the system has been named, you will be taken to the Manage Elements page. This is your dashboard for all the elements in the system. From the Manage Elements page, you can add new elements to the system, edit existing elements, and add IP devices to control. This page will pop up automatically during initial system setup, and you can get back here at any time by navigating to the System Settings page. Audio elements will populate automatically. To connect the lighting elements to the system, you must put them into pairing mode. If the devices have not been installed before, they will start up in pairing mode. If the elements were paired to a different system before, you can follow these steps to put a device into pairing mode. To put a TL4 into pairing mode, press and hold the top and bottom button for approximately 10 seconds, or until you hear a double click from the element. After a short period of time, the backlight on the TL4 will begin fast pulsing in heartbeat mode, indicating that the device is ready to pair. To put a TLLMP into pairing mode, press and hold the small recessed button on the side of the device for approximately 10 seconds. After a short period of time, the blue LED on the top of the TLLMP will begin slowly blinking in heartbeat mode, indicating that the element is ready to pair. Now that all your remaining elements are in pairing mode, make sure you are on the Manage Elements page of the app and press the button in the bottom left labeled Start Pairing. After reading the instructions in the dialog, press the OK button to continue. Now, just wait for all the elements to connect. Maybe get a cup of coffee or catch up on your emails while we do all the hard work for you. If all your elements have been found, press the Complete button and wait for elements to indicate that they are connected. TL4 elements will have the backlight off. TLLMP elements will have a solid blue LED on the top off. AZSS1 elements will have a solid blue LED on the front.